the only way that a person out here could be losing is if we are playing a game we didn't know we were in to begin with. And I think, um, like I've been saying um, at this address, of course we are. I mean, it's just, but these are your rules, people. And this is the point I keep pushing. You have these rules, okay, for other people. And so because you made those rules and you didn't share these rules and put the rules up front like you did for each other or for, like it was done for you, you actually caused people uh, to step over your lines. So to that, I mean, if you're just going to set an invisible trap out here in the middle of, of California and you're going to, you know, show up one day and say, well, I'm sorry, my attorneys, uh, you know, or we withheld uh, a couple thousand dollars from you because you were driving around on this road at this time. And I needed you to actually be over there because you were playing that radio station in your car. Um, if you're going to do things like this and set these kind of invisible booby traps, then um, you're going to have to apply those, your rules, okay, to everybody. And especially where you're doing this in this, in this town here in this particular area um, because you did it using us. Okay. So see, we are you. And so what's going to happen is that the person who then cast those rules upon you are going to have to do the same darn thing. I mean, when it's, it's this, you see this motion now we look like we're different. Okay. Opposable. It, we, we don't have opposable thumbs. We have an, a, a thumb that opposes the pointing finger. Okay. And so we aren't always in touch with each other. So by the time you come around and you, you know, your case and you've sifted through all these points and you finally stopped and gotten to this point, then you're going to realize that we are of the same hand. So you're going to have to just put, put my chips or whatever they be, my fish and chips, my free lunch. You're going to have to push it over here so that then I can meet your updates and, um, and go ahead and keep on going forward with whatever plans that we have together um, down the road some. Because at this point, you have been at the furthest end of the pointing finger, and I have been way down here at the thumb, um, working on curling around so I could get to these updates. Um, I do, I am in fiber, and that's because I work that way. I see it this way. We are working with the fiber of space and time, and you are far away in your reality. You have appointment after appointments. You're in a different wealth class. You've got all kinds of stuff that you have to do. You're on the road. You're probably flying here and there. Um, we haven't gotten there to meet each other yet. So don't pre -dam. Um, You won't want that because um, uh, people... Oh, you're probably here because you're you're paired with people who are really good at something. Um, and people here are really good at something. So you're going to want to keep that opportunity. Also, I don't think that adding people to dates in between here and there is going to be the right idea necessarily before we're able to at some point maybe just sit down in a casual outdoor environment and have a little chat, maybe jot a couple of notes down and um, sort these things out before things get carried away and we end up both having to, you know, um, sell our last uh, favorite antique piece of furniture, which I, I really wouldn't want to do. Yeah, I don't think you would either, or you wouldn't be here. <laughs>